six yard area just on the edge of his penalty box and kicks it long up towards Zhao it's nodded away comes back towards Sam Hudson but he can't control it but Wednesday got it with Sasso now Lopez Lopez carrying it forward down this left channel he works it into the feet of Wiggins Wiggins looks to try and get away from Ensu and he might do but Ensu shows his strength and his pace to get back at him and make the interception but Wednesday could get it here with Lopez they will get it working it across into Wallace slips it on is this a shooting chance for Zhao he does get a strike away on it it deflects away for a corner it wasn't a clean strike by any means though Wednesday on the attack but they are being forced backwards here and Tom Lees will get the ball and he'll use Lewis Price his goalkeeper Price has gone short for Sasso does he know that there's players around it's a little bit dicey but I suppose that's the confidence that these uh, players have got looking to play football from the back but Middlesbrough have got the ball here with uh, Adam Reach left hand side he's been tackled by Jack Hunt and the outcome is a corner for Middlesbrough we go for the short routine that's an option but I think they'll look to fire it in there is a man over there it's Clayton who's just uh, waiting for the ball he does actually get it and it's turned back to the corner taker into the middle it's the centre of the goal Middlesbrough try and force it in but a flag goes up there but Price jumps on the ball in any case but a slight moment of concern there for Sheffield Wednesday if you look at Lewis Price now he's, he's had to go right over the far side Downing's going to try and put this in uh, Lewis Price's top left hand corner but it's taken it hits the wall slammed in there comes back to Middlesbrough just on the edge of the area and uh, by the way, Hudson's back on the field. It's crossed into the middle. Wednesday haven't cleared the lines and eventually a volley comes in at the back post. It was a hooked effort from Downing. Wednesday they need to bring it down, but Kike's uh, managed to grab this one and bring it to the floor. Kike trying to get away from his marker. Sam Hudson made a tackle then. Went out the towards the left-hand side. He's come towards Fabrini. He'll get the crossover, will he? No, because Jack Hunt watches the ball rather than the man's fancy footwork, but it will be a corner kick. Well, they're very bright and quick. They've already taken the corner, Middlesbrough. And they need to be alive to that as the cross comes in from Clayton into the centre and it's tipped over the top by the goalkeeper. Kike with the header, probably four or five yards away from the goal line, but Price was equal to it, flicking it over the top. It will be another corner for Middlesbrough. That's dangerous there. He should have scored, really. We need those two to get that understanding that we saw in the first uh, couple of times we saw them in the opening game of the season here is uh, Zhao in the box though looking to make an angle he gets a shot away not an awful lot of power again on it but the goalkeeper had to make a save of sorts well it, it was blocked I mean he's he stepped one way was he going to hit with his right eventually he's pulled it onto his left good defending from Middlesbrough but Zhao but just showing what he is capable of if we can get him the ball more often yeah, just thinking back, he had that other deflected effort didn't he, early on in the first 10 minutes. Yeah. So he's been the most likely goal scorer for Wednesday so far. Wednesday winning it back here as well with Wallace in sharply, dispossessing for Breen. Oh, easy pass ball out was an easy ball though. He just went towards Matthias and it was intercepted. And Borough come the other way. It's with Downing. Stuart Downing cuts this back towards the edge of the area. A chance for Borough to score, but it's Great saved save. by the goalkeeper. Reach fired it in, but it wasn't out of reach of Price. And it's a good save, round for a corner. It's gone into Jack Hunt. What's he going to do this time? He again goes with a long pass, looking for Lucas Shout. The defender was competing with him and got something on it, but it's come back for Semedo. Semedo tries a 1 2 with Marco Matthias. His control wasn't great. Wiggins wrestling with Downing, but it's Downing who shows his strength. And he comes away and finds the perfect pass over towards that left hand side. It's a great pass as well, picking out Reach. He's going to look up and try and take on uh, Jack Hunt. Sticks out his leg, loops it away. It's going to be a corner kick. I think this time it will be fired in by uh, Ledbitter straight away from the corner. That is indeed what happens. In it goes. And it's, uh, well, it's not away. And it's come back towards Middlesbrough, who scored the opening goal. And it's Adam Rich who powers it in. Not great defending from Wednesday. A little bit messy in amongst it all. And Rich just a uh, pullback, a left footed trigger, and lashes it into the net. And I can't say it wasn't coming. 41 minutes have been played. And it's Sheffield Wednesday nil, Middlesbrough one. We've had a go, haven't we? We've just had a go this second half.
crowd really responded to it. In fact, the, the crowds will feel that, won't they? Yeah, yeah. 20,976 here this afternoon. On the halfway line, Sasso's touch is a heavy one, and that's allowed Fabrini to come away with it. He's going through the middle. Against he two. has support, but he's just overrun that one, and Tom Lee's able to Tom make Lee's. the tackle. But it was a poor touch from Fabrini that offered him the chance to do that. He could have released it, I think, sooner on the right hand side. Here is Ati Nuiu, plays it in for Marco Matias, coming in from the left hand side. Plays it short for Lopez. Lopez carries on the movement. Wednesday work it towards the right-hand side. Jack Great ball. First up. Time cross goes into the middle looking for Atinuiu. Headed away towards the edge of the area. Marco Matthias hits it. Deflection. Yes! Goes into the roof of the net. Off the deflection. The goalkeeper can't get there. Constantopoulos. He just took it up and over his head. Into the back of the net. The shot was with the edge of the area. And Wednesday's persistence has paid off. And it's her first goal at Hillsborough for Marco Matthias. He scored at Leeds last weekend. He now gets one at our home, at Hillsborough. It's Sheffield Wednesday, one, Millsborough one. Game of two halves, you would say. Here is Lopez to take the corner. It's planted in short. towards the front post and it's cleared away by Friends. And Jack Hunt's going to pick it up. He keeps it in play, does Jack Hunt. And tosses it back towards the box. Knew you the target, flicked on. Tom Lee's just slightly behind him. Also, Sasso was waiting a little bit further away in the penalty area, but the break's on, and it's gone in towards Fabrini. He's running in on goal, Fabrini scores! Wednesday hit on the counter-attack, Fabrini in from the angle, rolls it past Lewis Price, into the bottom corner, and after all that excitement and optimism, Wednesday fall behind again, Sheffield Wednesday 1, Middlesbrough 2, the perfect counter-attacking goal, and I guess it's because Wednesday took chances, because they're two centre-halves, we're up on the edge of the box. Towards the halfway line, Ati Nuiu controls it, uses his strength to touch it on. Sugu needs to get moving, but Friends should be there first. But he might take it out for a corner because of the pressure applied by Wednesday's substitute. Into the goal, taken by Lee towards the penalty spot. Tom Lees gets up well, and the header inches goes wide. wide by inches. As you say, the goalkeeper was scrambling to get across to it, but it is wide. I think the referee will add it on, though. Jack Hunt tries to win the header. He's gone back inside, but Middlesbrough have got possession and it's worked over the top there by uh, Leadbitter. He's found you. David Nugent has moved it on. This could be a chance to wrap it up for Middlesbrough. They have wrapped it up into the bottom corner. A cool finish there from Stuani, I think it is. He's taking the uh, applause from the Middlesbrough fans who are in their numbers in the top tier of the Leppings lane. Wednesday caught again, though. Corner. It's played in there, and there's another header in on our goal. It's saved by Price. It ricocheted back off the post, but that was a chance to make it 4-1 for Middlesbrough. Chucked back in there by Nugent, but uh, that was a, a scare, to say the least. It could easily be yeah. another goal for Stuani. Now here's Samedo, lifting it up towards New Yu. He nods it on for Kieran Lee. Lee wonders where it'll go. It's going to be worked back to his goalkeeper by uh, Gibson, and the referee will yeah. blow the full-time whistle. The and Middlesbrough will take the points here from this clash here at Hillsborough.